Now then. There's something you need to understand about ambiguities. This may require you to have a quantum computer for a brain, but some say you do. Your thoughts are electric. They move at the speed of light. They are both stuck in time and fluid in time at the same time. Don't let it frighten you. But consider this. Those who do not learn from history are doomed to repeat it. So if you're finding mysterious ambiguities in your world, you may want to ask yourself what it is about your system that allows history to repeat itself. You may want to search through your works for something Spanish-shaped. Oh hey, I love your cosplay. I cosplay too. Guys always hit on me when I do. It's so rude. You're hot. Can I sit on your face? Look, it's not cosplay and you're not a real geek. How would you know? Because I'm a real wizard. And a real geek, as it happens. Fine. Prove it. This potion brings out your best attributes and shows everyone the state of your heart. Oh my flying spaghetti monster, this is so sexist. How can you watch this? The human body is natural. Contrary to popular belief, it doesn't possess any magic powers. Yeah, it's mostly just levers and pulley systems, but it's pretty cool. You should check it out sometime. Excuse me, but who even are you? Who wrote this fucking joke, bitch? Now drink that potion angrily. Holy shit, you're a giant cunt! No, really! You've become a giant cunt! You'll notice a lot of these critters don't look like woodland critters. Well, that's because they don't want to look like anything. Anything except the most unique kind of victim they can think of. Hence the retro glasses. Help! I can't see! I'm stuck in a time warp where they haven't invented very focals for my empty frames. Hence the exotically dyed hair. Help! I got attacked by the wrong color, but I'm soldiering on somehow. Oh, uh, what do I know? I'm a fucking panda. Yeah, check it out. Domestic exterior. We're getting there. We're getting there. There's supposed to be some oak decking all along here, but we can't get any purchase for the truss beam, and the flanges are all out of whack. I don't know what to tell you. This place is falling apart. Hey. Okay, so what else? Oh, hey, um, I could have sworn I just heard the worst noise ever made. Yeah, I'm not sure what it's trying to say. It's probably the most ironic thing it could possibly say. That'd be shut up. That'd be a little bit more than shut up. Okay, so what's the... Ah, okay. You've seen one of these before? Of course I have, I'm a journalist. So what's it trying to say? Well, it's telling us to shut up. It's actually shut up, huh? How does it even hear us talking? Over its own titanic shrieking. You can see your lips moving from miles away. That means you've got a soul, and it doesn't like things having souls. So it's like a succubus? No, it's more like a blowyabus. It screams so loud your soul gets blasted out through your sphincter. We need something without a soul. Do you have a soul? How many do you need? None. Nuns don't have souls. Do you know any nuns? None. Awesome! So yeah, do you know what that is? Well, yes, that sounds exactly like something on my list of shit I'm never going near. I may not have a soul, but I've got a few critical faculties I'd like to keep. I'm kind of busy with a project. Is that project something that could help us in this particular episodic dilemma? Ah, that would explain it. How long's that been there? About 96 frames. Don't ask me how I did it, but I created a honey badger that runs on gingivitis instead of a soul. Did this involve DNA? Do not ask me how I did it. According to the usual stage development schedule, it should be still in the beta stage. But gingers evolve faster than usual. Everybody knows that. Hi, ginger badger. D do you know who you are? Do you need, like, a, a mission protocol? Get out there! 
try and make sure it doesn't incite any real life violence. <laughs> Do not shut up. Tell me your thoughts. Tell me your dreams. Never, ever stop speaking. This is you. Was that insightful? Yeah. No, I mean, no, I mean... Eh, yeah, it's workable. Yeah. This may surprise you, but I don't believe in violence. I will destroy an entire fictional multiverse if I need to, but I will not condone any violence against even the most loathsome denizens of a non-fictional universe. You'll notice this is almost the diametric opposite of political correctness. I am what you might call an antisocial injustice conscientious objector. They say the most dangerous animal is the intelligent sheep, but that's because they never heard of the evil panda. It won't even think of raping you. It's far too busy fucking you in the head. Now, I know what you're thinking. It's another tree. Don't worry. It's just a fruit tree. We're not going the same way this time. I was right! Well, not quite. Look at me! I'm an object! Huh? I object to that remark. I'm an object! Everybody hates me and wants to have sex with me! Okay, wrong, mostly wrong, and wrong. The boogeyman is invisible! Girls live on Venus and don't get enough phosphorus! 76% of Ugandans think a coil is a kind of snake! Boys have five balls! My Are we gonna eat that? Are you kidding me? Have you any idea what's inside it? That thing even touches me, I'm gonna shit out of my mouth. It might not be safe to have that thing bouncing around. I'm pretty sure it's got a 10-foot radius around it where all the flowers are dying. Meh. It's not like a million children are going to take it seriously. It's kind of right for the honey. The badger cave. Oh, shoot. Is anybody at home? Hug is not rape. I'm made of fruitcakes and cheese wheels and oppression. People give so much attention to bouncy, vapid bimbos. Look at me. You want to play a game, don't you? I'm going to get raped, aren't I? <coughs> I mean, I'm going to get raped, aren't I? Okay, cut. One more. Uh, I'm going to get... You are not going to get raped. Huh? Ever. Wow, it's like 
She's got three ants. Yay! Everybody, look at me. I mean, listen to me. You shouldn't reduce me down to my sexuality. Wow! She's got four ants. clue what these are about, you know. It's better that way. All animals are equal. The problem with animals is most of them are aware of this and yet simultaneously cannot understand it. They don't know what an animal is. But they know which moving shapes they trust and which moving shapes they do not. So if you're a social species with particular moving shapes soft-wired into your brain, then you're going to have to take very counterintuitive steps to try and escape your natural inclination to believe that some animals are more equal than others. And if you need to escape your nature, well, do you happen to know any fellow critters within your kingdom who are exceptionally good? That's escaping. Hi. I think it's very rude of you and very typical of you to imply that I can't just be living my life and being happy. I must be high, right? I was just saying- I know what you were doing, you were interrupting me, and that's what happens every time I talk, someone interrupts me. I was saying hi in So you're interrupting me again. That's very disrespectful. Every time I try to- Every time I try to talk, you talk over me. It's very rude, and I- If I actually interrupt, will you listen? I think it's very rude. Okay, so that works. I don't know why that works, but that works. Excuse me, but as a white devil badger, you have no business talking in my presence at all. A what? White devil badger always patronized me, and scolded me, and sent me to my room, and spanked me. Dude, what's a white devil badger? I'm like, charcoal gray here. I wouldn't know, I didn't see color. You're making everything about color so you can tell me what to do, which is absolutely what white devil badgers always do. This is probably going to be a very short cartoon. You just called my cartoon short. I think that's highly offensive. Y yeah, you shouldn't get too close to me. I'm not going to listen to your opinion, and I'm going to- Seriously, it was hard to turn me into an evil cartoon because I'm almost always nice, but that's because I- <laughs> That's why I knew this would be short. And stupid. Did you just call me st- The universe is destroyed now. What do you have to say? I just told you I'm not going to enact that list. You deal with it. What color are you? Black and white. I'm even more... <laughs>